Hello Mallards, it is Sunday. I'm about to leave to head to Beth Marshall's Top Teen Showcase. Uh, but there are two things I would like to discuss before I head there and my video is all about that. Uh, one, it has now been two days since I went bouldering with Danielle. My arms and legs just want you to know that. They also wanted me to know that as I attempted to do anything today, like hold up this phone. Uh, the second thing that I would like you to know is that yesterday I watched all of our flag means death at Mary's behest. Uh, and then I was up until 5 a.m. watching TikToks and looking up other stuff. And then I got back up at like 10 a.m. And now it's 1245. And I'm still not recovered and nor do I think I ever will be. So if you've seen our flag means death and you have fanfic wrecks or video wrecks or any anything else, Leave it in the comments, I'll watch it. So I know I've been to the Ren like a bunch in the last few weeks, but I haven't really spent time in this room. Uh, so I feel like I need to show off the rainbow wall they did, which is beautiful. It also continues on the floor. Absolutely lovely. Uh, but yeah, here we go. Some top teams. Time. Like this beautiful top team right over here. Uh, and all of the other talented people are gonna do a showcase. I get to see all of the amazing things that they've done, and I'm so excited. Oh, also, Steven's, Steven's here. Yes, I am back in my car for the postscript instead of like in the theater, but that's partially because they had some like judging and adjudicating and Q&A stuff that they were doing afterwards, because I think they do like awards for scholarships and things after this presentation. So I didn't want to stay because like we were being dismissed and I needed to do my very classic say goodbye to people a hundred times which meant that I spent a lot of my time doing that and couldn't record but I so enjoyed watching all of these top teens perform it was very very impressive Rowan who was my stage manager at Play in a Day did a great presentation on all of his technical theater projects and got to show off some of the things that he'd done, which was really, really cool. And Emerson did the same with her technical stuff. And then the other people performed monologues and songs. And it was really awesome to watch. They're incredibly talented. I took pictures of a bunch of headshots and resumes because I will be reaching out to some of these people that are hanging around the Florida area in the future. And it was just nice to see some of the other lovely people who are part of Beth Marshall Presents and the lovely Beth Marshall herself. Uh, they have a GoFundMe that is still active for the top teens. So there's a link down there to that GoFundMe. Please, please, please go support it if you can. Uh, if you have any amount of money to donate. All the money goes directly to those teens to help them with scholarships and to help the program grow. And it really is a very amazing program for the youth in the Orlando area that I want to continue for a long time. And now I'm going to go home and I'm going to do laundry and I'm going to do some blogging and I'm not going to waste all of my time doing our flag mean stuff. stuff but I might waste some of it. We'll see. In case you just really wanted to know what I did with the rest of my evening, I did write some blogs that I needed to write for my job, uh, checked some emails, did some other general housekeeping, like literally my housekeeping stuff. Uh, and I watched a bunch more TikToks based on our flag mean stuff and several fan vids, looked up some of the fan fiction and wrote a parody song that I may be gonna sing at Musical Mondays tomorrow. Uh, because our flag means death has taken over my life and I haven't really talked about it on this uh, vlog yet because I did some other stuff but uh, you know if I find a day this week where I don't have anything else to tell you we can talk at length for sure.